Sebastian, it's for you. Oh, Emma, Good. You can tell whoever it is to bugger off. I'm not in. Bugger off. I'm not, uh, he's not in. I don't think it works. Well, whoever this intruder is, I give him a damn good caution. Can't anyone tell I'm in a painful or rather difficult stage of my over-eventful life. <laughs> so the weapons are... Um... <clears throat> Hi, oh, Sebastian. I see you're going to talk to your nice friend. Well, I'll go make a cuppa. Coffee? Mr... Uh, I didn't quite catch your name. Weeper! Gwim Weeper! But you can call me Gwim. Black, please, no sugar. I had a bit of a rough night last night. And I suppose you want one too? Uh, the... Uh, yeah, yes, not much sugar. Lashings of cream. And, uh... No coffee. Uh, hello, um, nice weather we've been having recently. Fine, yes, lovely. And why are you here? I have come to reclaim what is rightfully mine. Uh, what, 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 what could that be? Uh, did, did you drop something of sentimental value last time we met? I have come to weep your soul and to turn it to the pits of hell! Uh, couldn't, couldn't you take someone else's? Uh, hundreds of people are literally dying to be killed. Uh, Kevin's got quite a nice soul. You could always take his. I could get thrown out of the union for that. And anyway, Kevin is destined for greater things. Prepare yourself, mortal! Oh wait! You, you can't do that. Why not? Uh, well, I'm not dead anymore, am I? Yes, you are! No, I'm not. Oh, yes, you are! Oh, no, I'm not! Oh, yes, you are! Oh, no, I'm not! Oh, yes, you are! I'm bloody well not! Oh, okay. Why not? Because I inhabit a body that is perfectly well, and it intends to stay that way. That's just possession! Well, possession's not intense to the law. You might have something there. I'll have to check up on that. Got a light? No, I don't. It's a filthy habit. You should give it up before it kills you. Oh, well, worth a try. <clears throat> I shall return! Monkey. William's gone off and we can use coffee. My guy. So that was death. Then I didn't recognise him. Yes, he demanded my son. How to get rid of him? Well, I told him if he didn't stop bothering me, I'd give him one of my famous cautions. He soon left with his side between his legs. I can tell What is it now? The wall was bleeding! Uh, that's not blood on, boy, that's tomato ketchup. That's tomato ketchup and my heap of old vegetables. Definitely ketchup. Oh no! The wall was bleeding ketchup! Don't swear, old boy. What would it mean if the wall was bleeding ketchup? Don't swear! Ah, I have to think about this to the hat's room. Now to visualise my thinking. Cap. 
This is the mix. Some massive tomato ketchup glory spontaneously combusted in our kitchen. Or some demonic demon is coming to get me. When I died, I went straight to the pits of hell. Satan's own demon is bound, holding my soul in merciless torment. Which is rightfully his by by right. Of course that will never happen. I'll offer a spot of sunbathing. Wait for me. Come on, Kevin, let's go sunbathing. This looks like a nice spot, Kevin. Yeah. Take it off, come on. I will, I will. Want to get a suntan, don't I? <laughs> don't know what's on this thing. dry grass. Dude. It was horrible seeing you die like that. I'm sure it was. The sink falling on you from that high. Yes, well. <laughs> you standing there like a gibbering idiot, not knowing which way to run. Uh, and it's slicing through your belly. Ew, it's blood and gets everywhere. It's horrible. Oh. Hey, so you enjoyed yourself then, did you? No, hey, not at all. It was horrible. Uh, how did Shark Spain take it? Don't you know? It, you know? It's a bit funny. Trust him to find amusement in my device. You know. When reality hit him, he couldn't cope. He just took it all as a game. He went a bit funny. Well, where is he now then? Wormstall Asylum. <laughs> yes, we're very pleased and proud of that. This little rehabilitation centre. We accommodate some of our most dangerous, psychologically different patients. I believe you are familiar with a few of the moment. The Judgment, for example. It's because of your type of treatment, they're in this state at the moment. Oh, improving nicely then, are they? No. So, how would you care to see your friend now? Yes, please. <laughs>
and it took three policemen to remove the errant pillow. And, well, there's some late news just in today. Hi, oh, here it's Bob Beckman, the fastest reporter in the West, reporting on this latest news. What can it be? Hold on, this is exciting on the biggest and best radio and TV station in the world. The name psychotic felons, turbo, doctor phobic, and lying bastard. Yes, that's what it says here, lying bastard. The that's completely illegal, I can't say that on TV, sorry. Escape from Worms or Asylum today. If seen, do not approach. They are dangerous, do not approach. One more time, do not approach. Dr. Slickfield, director of the Institute, gave no comment. Ha. That's Dr. the end of this news flash. And the latest news of the day, <laughs> police toilets have been taken and they have nothing to go on. Isn't that rather embarrassing, folks? Crisis up again at Tesco, complete disaster. Financial normal, uh, might resign over this. Um, and David Mellon does more news in over David Mellon, but there always is. <laughs> and what's this one? David Mellon has a Sebastian's washbuckle scandal? I don't believe it.